Here we have a function that is dividing by x squared plus 1. So for a domain, when you're dividing by something, you have to make sure that that thing is not equal to 0. Well, here, if I subtract 1 from both sides, I get x squared cannot equal negative 1. Well, if I try to take the square root here, I'd get x cannot equal, I'd get plus or minus the square root of negative 1. But that's an issue right there, okay? The square root of negative 1 is not a real number. And so that means there's actually no real number that makes x squared plus 1 equal to 0. So there's no restriction on our domain. So our domain is all real numbers. We can indicate that with this fancy block R, or we can notate it with interval notation from negative infinity up to infinity, or we could just state all real numbers.